a big trout fishing area once we get on up here a little bit I don't understand RVs like this like big campers or whatever you pay a whole bunch of money to get one just to live like you're in a trailer park moments like that when I complain about having to buy tires over 1500 miles to say Clint's Mountain Fee fishing area well I'm not fishing so squirrel I think there might be a lake up here somewhere oh in-state maintenance Woo always a good sign out of the state maintenance and now we're on a paved road that's got speed bumps somebody lives here Hunter access real ow shit. Up there though. You think I'd see that. That's way up there. Pretty. Magical. Which way do I go? Let's go this way. I'm not actually sure where this goes. I just know we're going up. That's thick. <laughs> That's thick gravel right there. It's like being in sand. So if we can't do the do a little better this time. I feel like they've just put new gravel down on the inside of these really sharp turns. We're definitely going straight up the mountain though. This ain't coming. I'm gonna take it a little wide out here and stay out of that thick stuff. So it just keeps wanting to dig into that. down there Look at those waterfalls how pretty is this log trucks log trucks yes no signs at all telling where that went so we're just gonna stay on this one I guess uh oh panther lick hunter access road does that mean this or that's got a gate on it. Wildlife management area. Gate. That's a shooting ring. Oh, crap. <laughs> this is gated. <laughs> There's a big ditch there that I wasn't paying attention to. I'm assuming that's a shooting range back there. That's a under access road. It's closed. It's another hunter access road that's closed. And these hunters got it good. This should be a column like nature lovers access roads. So I just go back there anytime without a gun. I'm not anti-gun, I'm anti not being able to go where I want to. I know I've complained about gates before. I complain about gates a lot actually. It gets on my nerves. Because anytime you ask them why the gates are closed, it's always some uh, bullshit reasons you know <laughs> it's so hard to speed up and it's so hard to slow back down because these gravels are so small and so loose you just spin 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 and then as soon as you touch the rear brake shh, it just locks up look how pretty this is though pretty little spot and you can see fish there's one right there we're going to the lake, we're going to a lake, we're going to a lake that I've never ever seen. You can tell there's a lot of traffic on this road. Because uh, it's washboarded out so bad anytime it goes up a hill. almost be there by now. Uh, uh, that way to the lake or this way? Oh, holy crap, there's a lake. There's people here. 
damn it. I could do it, you know. I could just floor it. See if I could do that hydroplaning thing. <laughs> what a pretty place. Never knew this was here. I'm assuming there's more access on over there. Night camping. Whoa. Big turn out of nowhere. Laurel Bed. Lake. Laurel Bed Lake. 330 acres of watery goodness. <laughs> Hope nobody's coming here to launch a boat. Be kind of a bitch to get back out of there. Well, how about that? Laurel Bed Lake. Guessing probably 10 miles of dirt road to get up here. Very pretty. This is that moment where you pulled up too far and you have to pull it bike backwards. Whew. Whoa, 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 whoa. A damn cool place. <laughs> 